The Psychonaut started out here, in the heart of the forgetful forest. There's a compound deep in these woods, protected from intrusion by psychic devices, traps, and illusions. I think Lucy's trying to get in, trying to go home. Remember, mad later, mission first. Now stick close. I'll show you how to get through. Agent Cruller? I hope I didn't lose him in the woods. Wow. It's really all still here. The Great Needle Gulch. So much history here. I mean... This is where you assembled the team that would become the Psychonauts. This is where you first discovered Cytanium. Where Otto made his first psychoactive devices. Where Cassiopeia wrote her books. Where Helmet Fulbear workshopped his psychodicy. Where Bob Zanotto and Compton Bull pioneered communication with plants and animals. And where... where... This is where it all began. No, Raz. This is where it all ended. lying around. Do you know where you are? What can you tell me about this place? I... Oh, I think... I think I used to keep the cinnamon over there. Oh, we don't have much time. Her old memories are coming back. What's going to happen? Listen, Raz. This compound... We got into some pretty far-out stuff here. I've read about... The kind of stuff they don't write about in true psychic tales, okay? We all pushed each other to go farther, to broaden our consciousness, to open every closed door in our minds. It made us defenseless, psychically. But we were in a safe place here. We had each other. Then her homeland was attacked. She insisted on helping. I begged her not to go in that condition. It's so vulnerable. Ah, war brought something out in her that... Should have been locked away. Maligula. After the deluge, I brought her back here and closed those doors again, with Maligula on the other side. How? With the astrolathe. A powerful tool we developed to make alterations to our psyches. That doesn't sound safe. Now you wouldn't understand. It was an age of exploration. But you're right. 
We were messing with powers we didn't understand, and now I have to clean up this mess. But I'm not the psychonaut I used to be, Rasputin. I need your help. What do you need me to do? First, I need you to go to the Heptodome and prepare the astrolathe. I stay here and keep a close watch on her. Be right back, Nona. Away from the river, booty! Aha! I knew I had some chewing tobacco hidden in here! Harmless to me, but that's probably Is that straight thoughts I'm picking up. This is where the first Psychonauts met. And this must be the Astral Lane. Well, I'll just turn this thing on then. Well, those are thick and thorny. I'm gonna need a little help here. I'm not touching that thing again until I get rid of the bees and vines. This is where they sat! This is where they plan their voyages across the astral plane. Check out these new time bubble pins. Let's combine that Psychor with your car. Ooh, I should get some of those too. My mental energy has been lagging a little. Just what I was going to recommend. Perfect. Ayanara Psychic.
What's a psycho-isolation chamber doing out here? That's not right. Wow. This must be the first ever psycho-isolation chamber. Created as therapy, later used to punish kids at summer camps. all the exotic animals. This must be where Compton kept his menagerie. Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with my clairvoyance. card lying around. This used to be Otto's workshop. Looks like it went out with a bang.
It's a picture of the Psychic Six. I mean, seven. slop and I don't think I can fit through it. needs a tune-up and a car wash and actually it smells like there's a skunk family living in there so never mind poor helmet's head must be cold Straight thoughts here. People might think this thought tuner looks dorky, but I think it's cool. Wrong bees. Smoke can get in your eyes. <laughs> Guess. 
Happy's smoke this. Hoop! <laughs> Victory over bees. What's wrong, you big bees? Can't take the heat. I'm not contributing to the global decline of bee populations. Oh, oh. Side, this phone sticks conveniently to your face while you're talking. Hello? Witch, you don't exist. You're just something someone put into my mind. Which means there's probably a very powerful psychic nearby. Another hallucination. A very solid hallucination. Oh man, are you gonna cast a spell or something? Who are you? How did you get in here? And where was our security, eh? Cassiopeia? Author of Mind Swarm? Ford Cruller brought me through security. Ford? Ford Cruller? Came back? Oh, I knew it! I knew he would. But I'm not ready. I've been trying to fix this place up for him, but don't you know these bees are so demanding? Ford wants me to turn on the astrolabe, but it's covered in, well, really angry bees. Know anything about that? Oh, I think I can help you with that. I'm just happy to be useful again. Get out of my way. Ford needs me. Oh, I can tend to the queen later. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. She says. I can't talk to you anymore. Wait! Cassie! Who's she? There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. 